December 28th, after some breakfast, it was time to hitch back up the boat and head up to West Palm Beach for some time with my daughter and a birthday lunch with the ex and her mom, then head on up to Titusville. I like Titusville because it's close to several refuges and sanctuaries, especially Merritt Island, and it's probably the most reasonable hotel rates in Florida. Upon arrival, I said hello to my astronaut buddy you might recognize from previous videos. He was still in the Christmas spirit. The gal at the desk asked, what brings you here? So I told her and she told me that there was a lot more wildlife action happening at the Orlando Wetlands than on Merritt Island. So I planned to head there in the morning. That place had lots of trails and not being familiar, I just grabbed my 30 plus pounds of camera gear, took my best guess and took off walking. My favorite moment was when I decided I was pooped and sat on a resting bench and a pileated woodpecker flew right over me to work on a hole in a palm tree just up the trail. Isn't it cute? I had seen many but never gotten any pictures of one before. The sand hill I kept here and was actually at the parking lot. I wouldn't call it a bus but definitely felt a little short on pics for all the walking I did. I decided I'd go ahead and stay another night so I got me some hungry howies and planned on heading out to Merritt Island in the morning. Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge is just north of the old Space Shuttle landing strip near Kennedy Space Center. There are several little bumpy one-lane gravel roads that meander throughout the wetland areas. Often the best and by far the most popular of these roads would be the Black Point Wildlife Drive. You can bet that for a known to be great drive like this, I'm going all in as far as which camera setup to use. The big idea is to drive nice and slow, keeping your eyes peeled for any wildlife that might be on the either side of the road or in a tree or bush. Aha, belted kingfisher. Ah, look, a reddish egret, eating some breakfast. Ooh, and Hinga. Let's go see what else we could find. There's not many birds prettier to me than a roseate spoonbill in the golden hour light. Ever see a grebe that thought it was Batman? Or eat its own feather? Check this out. I'm driving along Biolab Road now to see what I can see over by the Indian River shore. Oh yeah, look at there. That water is clearer than it looks. Check out this guy really hiding good in the bushes. Watching this ice spray reminds me it's about time for some lunch, Tommy. Let's go check out the beach just to say we did and then head on out of here. What another great day at the Merritt Island National Wildlife Refuge.